Welcome to EPG Patshala. I am Renu Arora, former Head Education and Training Division, CSIR Niskil, New Delhi. The module that we are going to cover now is Organization of Information Products and Services in International Organization. In this module, we will cover all the national organizations that are engaged in promotion of information activities. We will try to see the major organizations that offer services for our user communities in the field of sciences, social sciences and humanities. In the subsequent slides, we will give you an overview of the various organizations at national level. Although there are several organizations which are offering information at state and local level as well, but only the representative organizations have been covered. The objective of this module is to elaborate on national organizations that are engaged in the development of library and information services. We'll also recognize the organizations which are engaged in performing information functions in different subject areas. We'll also understand the role of these organizations in providing information to the target users. The programs and activities of these organizations are also explained as these are engaged in promotion, coordination, development of library and information services and we will identify and detail specifically the role played by some representative organizations. Information systems and programs in India can be divided into three categories. Information systems and programs in science and technology. Information systems and programs in social sciences, information systems and programs in humanities. Information systems and programs in science and technology. Some of the major information systems in science and technology are technology information facilitation program, biotechnology information system, environmental information system, InflipNet, that is the Library and Information Network, National Informatics Center, NIC, National Institute of Science, Communication and Information Resources, NISCARE, INDEST Consortium, Defense Scientific and Information Documentation Center, DESIDOC, and Indian Medular Center. India, like any other country, has a mission to provide multiple platforms for collaboration of scientific professionals and researchers to share existing knowledge and to generate new knowledge. For this, information programs and systems have been set up and the organizations which have just been listed highlight that all the major scientific areas are taken care of. Information systems and programs in social sciences. Social sciences are the study of human society and of individual relationships in and to the society. In other words, it is a scholarly or scientific discipline that deals with disciplines that include sociology, psychology, anthropology, economics, political science and history. In India, major initiative in the field of social sciences has been by the Indian Council of Social Science Research, ICSSR and its related bodies. These include Indian Council of Social Science Research, ICSSR, UGC Inter-University Center for International Studies, UGC Inter-University Center for Humanities and Social Sciences, Indo-American Center for International Studies. Some other organizations that provide support to social science research are Gokhale Institute of Politics and Economics, Indian Institute of Public Administration, SNDT Women's University Documentation Center, National Council of Applied Economic Research, Tata Institute of Social Sciences, Information Systems and Programs in Humanities. In India, several organizations have come up to promote and support research activities in the field of humanities. Libraries and information centers attached to these organizations help researchers and users in their work. Major organizations in the field of humanities are National Archives of India, New Delhi, National Museum, New Delhi, 
Indian Council of Cultural Relations ICCR New Delhi, Indian Council of Historical Research ICHR New Delhi, Indira Gandhi National Center for Arts New Delhi, National Mission for Manuscripts New Delhi. Let us now see some of the major organizations in each subject area. National Institute of Science Communication and Information Resources NISCARE. NISCARE came into existence in September 2002 following the merger of INSTOC and NISCOM. It has the chief objective of dissemination of scientific and technological information through various information products and services. The institute publishes 17 primary and 2 secondary scientific research journals. Besides various publications and information services, major national level projects for SNT community which are handled by NISCARE are National Science Digital Library, National Knowledge Resource Consortium, Digital Information Resource Faculty, NISCARE Online Periodicals Repository. NISCARE is an institution capable of serving the society using modern information technology infrastructure in a more effective manner and taking up new ventures in the field of science communication, dissemination and SNT information management systems and services. Broadly, the core activity of NISCARE is to collect and store, publish and disseminate SNT information through a mix of traditional and modern means which benefit different segments of the society. A very major national level institution in the field of social sciences is National Social Science Documentation Center, popularly called as NASADOC. NASADOC was established in 1969 as a division of ICSSR. Objective of NASADOC is to provide library and information support services to researchers in social sciences, those working in academic institutions, autonomous research organizations, policy making, planning and research units of government departments, business and industry etc. NASADOC provides guidance to libraries of ICSSR regional centers and ICSSR maintained research institutions. The ICSSR NASADOC library has a collection of reference sources which includes bibliographies, encyclopedias, doctoral thesis, research project reports, books on social science research methodology, computer and information technology, research surveys and on all social science disciplines. A major organization in the field of humanities is the Indira Gandhi National Center for the Arts IGNCA. IGNCA established in 1985 is a center encompassing the study and experience of all the arts. The chief aims of the center are to serve as a major resource center for the arts, specially written oral and visual source materials, to undertake research and publication programs of reference works, glossaries, dictionaries and encyclopedias containing the arts and the humanities, to establish a tribal and folk arts division with a core collection for conducting systematic scientific studies and for live presentations. The center utilizes multimedia computer technology to create a wide variety of software packages that communicate cultural information. This center comprises of five divisions. Firstly, Kalanidhi. Kalanidhi collects primary and secondary material on humanity. Secondly, Kalakosa, concerned with research and publication activities of Indira Gandhi National Center for Arts. Thirdly, Janpada Sampada. This complements Kalakosa with regard to eco-cultural, socio-economic context, lifestyle studies, multimedia presentation and events etc. Fourthly, Kala Darshan. This deals with exhibitions, lectures, conferences in areas of art and culture. And lastly, Sutradhara, Administrative Division and International Dialogue Unit. So, in this way we have seen that all the three subject areas are taken care of at national level. In this module, we have given you an overview of national information systems and program. We have seen that in all the subject areas that is science and technology, social sciences and humanities, there are several organizations 
which are offering information services to their users. In the paper, information sources, systems and services, we have seen that several modules have been devoted to various international and national organizations which are offering services at national level. So, as most of these organizations are offering services and have been covered in detail, in this particular module, we have not covered the organizations in detail. But for your information, all these organizations which have been listed in this particular module are offering national level library and information services. Each one has a library and information unit which is offering all the latest modern information facilities. The libraries have computerized catalogs are offering all the modern information services and excellent collection in the respective subject areas. So, in this module we have tried to list the various organizations. The details of these organizations are available from their websites which are listed in the text part of this module and the web sites are also providing other information regarding the organization. Hope you have gained an insight into the various organizations at national level. Thank you.